Hi, I'm John from the Mountain Goats, and what we're going to do is watch a song I played last night at the Cafe 11 show, and I'm going to uh, talk about uh, when I wrote the song and what it's about, and so on and so forth. Dance number. I always say that it's a dance number. Uh, since I don't have a drummer, people often don't obey me, uh, but I think that they should dance anyway. Uh, the song's called Southwood Plantation Road. It was about the sixth song I wrote for Tallahassee. And uh, what I had done is I'd gotten out maps of Florida because I was writing this story about a, a couple that goes down to Florida to sort of try and drink themselves to death or maybe drink their way to the solution of their crumbling marriage. I got you. You've got whatever's left of me to get. So the husband is who's singing. Our conversations are like minefields. No one's found a safe way through one yet. I spend a lot of money. I buy your white gold. We raise up a little roof against the cold on Southwood Plantation. Road. And I got out these maps and uh, and I would spread them around the house and hang them up and uh, and imagine Tallahassee, which I'd only ever been to once or twice at that point. You know, so it's sort of this mythical place for me, which I initially chose because it was it was the far end of the country from where this couple starts out, right? And uh, and I had this idea to sort of do this bottom feed along the country, getting drunk and getting thrown out of various towns until they wind up in Tallahassee and they run out of gas and money and steam, right? So so they buy a house. Uh, now, I didn't know anything about the town, so I just got out a map and I tried to find some place that was far enough from town that they could make a lot of noise and destroy a lot of shit, you know, without arousing a lot of suspicion. And uh, I looked at a map, and Southwood Plantation Road looked to be far enough away from any action, right, that that would work. And I uh, wrote to a friend of mine who lived in Tallahassee, and he said, Yeah, it's, nobody lives out there. But a couple years later, me and Peter were playing in Tallahassee after the album had come out, and we passed this condemned house, right? There's nothing there, and it just looked so busted and beat up. Uh, it was on Monroe Street, and uh, and we went up onto the property, you know, and the door is open. It was clear people had been squatting in this house, right? There's, there's Schlitz cans everywhere, you know, and cigarettes and broken glass, and it gave off the evil, evil, evil groove that some bad stuff had gone down in there. So to me, Southwell Plantation Road is actually a red herring, and the house is actually on Monroe. Right. Uh, the house plays a big part in these people's crumble. It sort of is the third, the third person in their marriage, because uh, they almost never leave. And so that's what the song's about. Uh, but it's kind of a celebration of how bad things have gotten. If you know how, like, if everything goes to shit, at some point you just sort of go, yeah, I can ride that out. I can do this. Right. I'm going to beat the situation just by going down, all the way down to the bottom. So that's kind of what the song is about.